same school. So we'll have to look at that. But even on the registration that we did went on after school day. Maybe before school. Well, before it gets out here. But yeah, it starts April 1st. It should start. Um, so that's the first thing. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. 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 Oh, fees. Okay. They're going to have a new TBY bell bylaw. Gresham already does it. Um, where you have to be paid before you practice. They're, they're making it to where you have to have. I guess what happened, it wasn't, this wasn't the best. Last year they had uh, Westland had 47, 48, 46 waivers. And um, so what they did is they had kids practicing and they didn't have the waivers. So they were just practicing, thinking, you know, hey, we'll have them here, they're going to practice and the waiver will sign them. So they're changing that, but they're also changing more people are completely, everything's taken care of. Because if you have, and Gresham already does this, because if you had somebody, let's say, um, they were going to play, and then they said, oh, we'll pay you later, and then you have four kids like that on the team, and all of a sudden the season starts, and they decide they don't want to play because the kid gets hit. And it happens, every year it happens. And then the parents are like, well, I haven't paid anything, so it's not going to cost us anything, so just don't play. And then you end up with one team maybe has 18 on it, 18 has 23. So they want it to be more of a concrete thing, or those are all the same. So if that one is going to come down, it should not affect us because that's more of a an issue with the bigger, bigger West Side Lake Elmer. So it should be all right. Um, I got that. Oh, one thing we did last year, sorry, is we um, we actually had the high school kids. They were here when we did the first week, okay, and then they helped with that camp. We're going to have to do the same thing. We'll do the same thing next year. I know that they're very good to us here with using the fields. They're not having to pay for the fields. And every year that comes up, but hopefully it won't be an issue. Mm -hmm. So, those are those. So, this is no, it can't be. It has to be, you can't do, before, and that's a good question, because before, if you coach, like say you coached a YMCA team, you couldn't coach a TUIFL team, and then the president's meeting in February, there's going to be a vote to make a bylaw. It's basically during the football season, June to, or whatever, maybe July. 